Hello world. My name is Paul with the Backyard Hibachi. Today, I'm gonna be teaching you how to make hibachi noodles. All right, first things first, we're gonna need our towel. Cutting board, nice and stable. And we're gonna be using five ingredients today. Carrots, cabbage, garlic, green onions, and bean sprouts. Alright, let's prep the carrots first. For the carrots, you just want to make diagonal cuts, thin diagonal cuts, like so. And you want to use a rocking motion. Let's move on to the cabbage. Cabbage, you want to press down on it a little bit so it flattens it out. Or you can even take you know, just this amount, flatten it out. And you use the same rocking motion. You want these fairly thin so they cook quickly. And the onions, you want to cut the root. And then cut them into two inch sections. And then again, just use the same rocking motion. Perfect. And now for the garlic. I just want to press on the garlic. Like so. Take out the, sh the peel. Now same rocking motion. Just kind of nice and small you can also throw these in the blender or the food processor so I got my water up to a nice boil we're gonna add some a few pinches of salt into the water the salt will help to keep the noodles al dente and about one tablespoon of oil and we're gonna give that a quick stir go ahead and drop the noodles in So in the restaurants we use uh, Canton noodles and you can find these at your local Asian store. And we're just going to stir occasionally to make sure the noodles don't stick together. And the way you want to check if the noodles are done, you're just going to grab one noodle and you just throw it against the wall see if it sticks. No, in actuality what you do is you, you grab one noodle and then uh, you break them and then you check the, the middle and when you want like a little little bit of raw inside there it's, it's probably about two two thirds of the way there because you're going to be cooking them more on the grill so these noodles right here are done we're going to be transferred into an ice bath so you got to let those noodles sit in the ice bath for about five to ten minutes and that'll stop the cooking process instantly all right now that your noodles are nice and cool you want to strain them out and let them sit for another about five minutes and let them dry up. All right, now that your noodles are dry, you're going to add a little bit more oil to coat the noodles so they don't stick to the grill. And you want to give that a nice little stir. Now they're ready to go on the grill. All right, so we got our vegetables prepped, our noodles cooked, and the grill up to temperature. It's time to begin cooking. First, you want to lay the oil down, coat the grill. Go ahead and throw the noodles on there. Throw these around. Green onions. Cabbage. Garlic. And the breeze box will save for last. Put the noodles around.
Uh, the vegetables are optional. Uh, most of the time at the restaurant, all we do is just add soy sauce, uh, garlic butter, and sometimes teriyaki. Uh, some restaurants also have lo mein sauce. Mix them in with your noodles. And soy sauce. I'm using light soy sauce. Or you can use regular soy sauce, no main sauce, or teriyaki sauce. Mix it and that's it for Habashi noodles. Nice, easy, quick recipe. Thank you for watching, guys. See you next time.